Now the string comes raveled inside of the, the trimmer of the weed whacker, but I wasn't sure if it was done correctly. So there are two uh, holes that you just press in to uh, relieve the cap. And once you get that cap relieve, you know, just unravel all of that string because there's no telling what they did at the factory. Now to load string into the Greenworks 60 volt trimmer, it's the easiest thing. All you have to do, there are two green dots on the side of the trimmer and a green dot on the head of the weed whacker. You wanna line those two dots up to make sure that they're connected, you see. And then what you'll do is You'll grab your string and you press the string directly through the head of the trimmer. It should go straight through. There we go. And then you pull it out the other side. And then once you get the string through, you kind of want to line them up as close as possible. Doesn't have to be perfect, but you want it as close as possible. And once you get it even, you'll come back and kind of press that out the way. Then you'll grab the head of the trimmer. And you'll just start twisting clockwise. Twist it real good. And it's gonna ravel it up inside of the head of the trimmer like it's supposed to be. If you haven't, make sure you like this video, subscribe to the channel. I would greatly appreciate it. Okay, now that we got the string wound up properly within the trimmer, you, know you want it to be kind of perfect. There we go. I know that may have sound loud, but the head of the trimmer was directly in front of the camera. Outside, when you're in the grass, it's not as loud as, as you think. It's very quiet. Thank you for watching my video. Make sure that you subscribe, like, and stay tuned for future content.